Whether stocking your kitchen for the first time or just taking stock of what you already have, you can't forget how important the right utensils are for food preparation. Here are the basics. Let's start with measurement. A collection of measuring spoons is a must in any kitchen. Whether measuring liquid or dry goods, these are essential to your success with recipes. For larger volumes, use measuring cups. For dry ingredients, fill them up and drag a knife across the top to keep your measuring accurate. This one is really useful. The graduated measuring cup. Notice that we have both metric and imperial. Older recipes or American ones will refer to imperial measures, so it helps to have both. I like to keep a utensil holder on my counter. It helps to have quick, easy access to your most frequently used utensils. Here we have a versatile large spoon. From stirring a stew to skimming liquid off soup, you will likely use this type of spoon more than any other utensil. This is a slotted spoon. If you want to pull vegetables out of a stock, for instance, this spoon lets you remove larger pieces without losing any liquid. The small ladle is perfect for serving sauces and gravies. Here is another specialized spoon with very small holes. Use this when you want to get small pieces out of a liquid that needs a fine straining. No kitchen is complete without a whisk. From beating eggs to making cake batter, a whisk is a fast way to whip up smooth and fluffy mixtures. Now for grating. This grater has large slots, which is good for a hard cheese like Parmesan. Beautiful curls of cheese grated over a plate of pasta make a great presentation. When a recipe calls for a zest of lime, lemon, or other citrus zest, the right grater can make all the difference. Here is a medium fine variation. In fact, you might find all three on a single multi-sided grater. The peeler is another traditional kitchen staple. Make sure your peeler is nice and strong. Potatoes, carrots, or any hard vegetable can require peeling. Use the pointed end to remove potato eyes or vegetable blemishes. Kitchen shears come in handy for cutting through chicken bones or roast strings. Make sure your shears are stainless steel with strong, sharp blades. There are a lot of different tongs on the market. These have a nice locking mechanism for easy storage. Good tongs are handy in the kitchen when you need to move food that is too hot to handle. These larger tongs are great for barbecuing because they keep your hands away from the heat. Food safety is the most important kitchen practice. A meat thermometer is critical to make sure your meat is cooked to a safe temperature. Get a good quality digital thermometer. Digital ones are easy to read and are also more accurate. This is a newer version of the kitchen brush. Made of silicone, this brush can really take the heat. Use it for basting meats, applying egg washes, or any time you want to spread liquid on a surface. A rubber spatula is another traditional staple in any kitchen. Notice its flexibility. This is the perfect utensil when you want to get every last bit of batter out of a bowl. You can find these in silicone as well, which is safe to use at high heats. This large ladle is the most efficient way to serve up soup, chili, or stew. Here we have a large spatula. We often see them in metal, but this silicone one is perfect for non-stick pans where metal would damage the non-stick coating. There are many different kitchen utensils to choose from, and the right ones can help cut down your cooking and prep time in the kitchen giving you more time to enjoy delicious meals with friends and family.